Hey creators, we're back with another awesome tutorial. And today, we'll teach you how to convert your boring looking 2D screen to 3D in Filmora. Without any further delay, let's start today's video. Before we begin, if you haven't already installed Wondershare Filmora, please visit the official website and download the latest version. Then, install it on your computer. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of our upcoming videos. You've seen the 3D screen effect in many videos and intros of any software. It is the best tool to introduce new software updates and features. People use software like After Effects, Premiere Pro, or DaVinci Resolve but you have never heard that it can be done in Filmora too. Easily, right? Let me show you how you can make it in Filmora. First, drop your footage onto the timeline. Then go to the effects, then go to the Boris FX folder, then go to the stylize, and you will see an effect called BCC Cast Shadow. Drop it on track two and match the duration with the clip duration. Now, go to the effect setting, then click on the image plane to open it. Select look to none, with position X, Y, you can adjust the position of your footage on the X and Y axis. With position Z, you can adjust the position of your footage on the Z axis. With rotation X, you can rotate your footage on X axis. With rotation Y, you can rotate your footage on Y axis. With rotation Z, you can rotate your footage on Z axis. With the master scale, you can adjust the scale of the footage. With scale X and Y, you can stretch your footage. Now, when you understand the functions of each slider, Place the playhead at the start of the footage on the keyframe on position X, Y, N, Z and for rotate X, Y, Z along with the master scale. Then, place the playhead at 5 seconds. It depends on where to place the playhead. Then first adjust the position Z and rotation X, Y, and Z with the master scale. All value depends on which area of footage you want to show your audience. Then, adjust the position X and Y. For position X and Y, use values in points like 0 0.35, 0 0.45, and so on. Then, move further to another point and adjust the value of position Z. Rotation X, Y, and Z, then adjust the position X and Y. Further, if you want to make this effect more dynamic, add Spotlight. For that, first shift Track 2 effect to Track 3 and off it. Then go to the Plus Light and apply BCC plus Relight on Track 2. Match the effect duration to main clip, then go to the effect setting, expand light, set blur X and Y to zero, then expand light source, and adjust the falloff radius. It's used to adjust the light radius. Then set falloff to zero. Further, you can use the BCC fast lens blur effect from the blur folder to create a camera depth. Place the BCC fast lens blur on track three, then set the blur to three, then go to effect mask and select circle mask and the mask shape then adjust the blur strength, then invert the mask and place the mask at the position and on path keyframe, then adjust the mask position as per the movement. That easy to convert 2D screen to 3D screen in Filmora. What are you waiting for? Download or update your Filmora version from the link in the description and give wings to your inner creator. If you found this helpful, please give this video a big thumbs up and share it with your fellow editors and creators. If you're interested in visual effects and tutorials, be sure to check out filmora.wondershare.com. See you next time.